Okie dokie, here we are yet again. Um, this time we'll be playing through Ancient Dunes, created by Sigma. Sigma? <laughs> Sigma, that's such a Swedish pronunciation. <laughs> Sigma. Loading level? <laughs> Loading level? Yeah, I don't know how you would pronounce it in Swedish. Who cares? You know, just. <laughs> just shut up. <laughs> just shut the heck up. Okay. Um. Oh gee. Oh, what? <laughs> My eyes get get really confused looking at the bottom of the screen here. Yeah, there is this Mega Man 2 tile, and then there is the background beneath it. Huh. That's interesting, though, how they kind of fit together. <laughs> wow. But yeah. Um. This is a forum posted level. Um. We play the Snake Temple, I believe it was called, from Sigma, you know, uh, a week or two ago. And I wanted to try out this stage as well. And you know, it looked pretty neat, judging by the screenshots over on the forums, and so, you know, yeah. That's really all there is to it. <laughs> hmm. And I actually really like the Alec Man mix in with the you know the golden bricks here wherever whatever game that they come from <laughs> yeah this kind of reminds me of Mega Man 4 you know in the start of Pharaoh Man stage with the sand here and oh man yeah I moved <laughs> moved through a little too fast there Finding too many enemies. You know, <laughs> there we have it again. The Mega Man Uh Oh, look at this! But yeah, as I was about to say, there. Um, I do notice quite a few people, you know, remaking stages from uh, Mega Man One and Two, but I don't see very much love for Mega Man Three and Four and Five and Six. A remake from those uh, games in particular. Um, <laughs> I don't know where I was going with that, but yeah, <laughs> I just brought it up for whatever reason. Uh, uh. Hmm. Probably, yeah, look at that. Got secrets. Yeah, the grey stones here is kind of what, you know, made my eyes um, oh, go, <laughs> go in that direction, basically. Oh, that's right, it takes six hits. <laughs> Shoot. You know, since it is quite an easy stage, you know, um, I will not... I will not take the handouts here, you know. I, I wanna, wanna keep it a little bit challenging. I'm thinking here, because why not? <laughs> That's the great thing, by you know, with with free will, you can do whoa, however you wanna do it. Oh shoot! Oh, <laughs> oh. It's looking really neat, I have to say. Really, really nice. Yellow and the pur purplish backgrounds. You know, the pur <laughs> purplish, pur purplish bricks. And dude, maybe, <laughs> maybe I should grab the elf. But no, I'm stubborn. I did read on the forums that... Oh, yeah, yeah. Hey! <laughs> that there is approximately approximately um what was it like 12 or 14 screens between each checkpoint so i should not be too far away <laughs> man one hit from these guys and i'm dead they did exactly four damage uh, i cannot screw it up oh no okay okay all right i will take those kind of drops 
<laughs> okay, well, regardless if that I dropped or not, I still would have made it. <laughs> Sue me. <laughs> oh, what the heck? Oh, oh, yes. Oh, no. <laughs> How do I shoot him? Dude. Uh, uh, no, no. Oh, yes, I'm not gonna make it. Okay, you know what? When he jumps. Yeah, there you go. That's pretty interesting, even though it looks a little bit funky, you know, having the sand <laughs> just floating like this. It's still interesting because if you sink too much... Come on! Ah! <laughs> yeah, if you sink too much, he's going to shoot you or he's going to burn you with the flamethrower thingy. <laughs> oh, ho, ho, ho. come on now. <laughs> Man, I got wrecked. Absolutely wrecked. Man, I was hoping I could do this without taking, uh, without taking any damage. And I guess, yeah, that's pretty cool actually. Um, if you just sink down, you know, in a spot where there is, you know, no fire, you could technically. Uh, sneak in a shot on him, like here. Dang, I did not sink that. Well. Yeah, and I guess it's a good idea to just keep a steady stream of bullets going here in case he jumps. Oh, yo, yo! Yeah, you know what? I'm just going down here. Okay, <laughs> there we are. Yeah, pretty neat. Pretty neat poster room. Thankfully, you know, the damage was, was set to two shots per uh, per bullet. Otherwise, that would have taken ages. <laughs> and it would have been a little bit <laughs> annoying. So yeah, that was a good choice there. Um, or a, a good call, I guess you could say. Uh, but yeah, pretty much like the Snake Temple. It was a, new, uh, a nice uh, level here. Um, let's see here, um, yeah, I guess the sand was the main gimmick of the stage, but I guess it was mostly focused on combat, pretty much like the snake temple. In the snake temple we had the green lasers, you know, shooting out of the snake heads. <laughs> um, but in this level it was more, well, I guess both levels was mostly focused on combat and not so much on platforming. Um, but, you know, both uh, levels plays nice and both levels looks nice, so yeah, and I th I'm trying to remember, in the first stage we had that plateau that you stood on and I believe we were fighting Crying Bubble Man and the Snakehead was like chiming in with his shells, that was pretty cool looking boss rooms. Uh, in this level we had, uh, yeah, you know, Flame Man here uh, and um, yeah, the sand there in, in the middle of the room so yeah you kind of had to keep had to keep yourself afloat or you would either get penetrated by the spikes or you would uh, you would toast you <laughs> uh, so yeah both boss rooms were quite cool uh, as well I feel like this one probably had uh, a more of a unique property to it which uh, was it was it was a really fun level to play here uh, and they're a really really cool boss room as well so yeah <laughs> Pretty nice level Sigma, um, it was a pleasure <laughs> pleasure to play it and yeah, I'm not very surprised that it has quite a few, you know, it, it has a 50-50% um, well, <laughs> I guess a 48% <laughs> upvote ratio at this point or something like that, I don't know, <laughs> you know, I'm, I'm, I don't have the cal calculator <laughs> on all the um, <laughs> 16 times 2 is 32, uh, yeah. No, wait, yeah. <laughs> okay, I have, I have had a few beers, so I'm not. not <laughs> yeah, I'm making excuses. <laughs> well, <I'm, laughs> uh, oh, shoot, don't do that. I did not know. With the left bumper, you can upvote and unvote on the controller. I had no idea. And the right bumper is downvote. 
What the heck? How come, how come I have not known that until now? Anyway, um, I just stopped talking now, I'm just dragging this out. Um, a very nice level, definitely worthy of the praise it has gotten here. Close to a 50% ratio, you know, in thumbs up. So yeah, that's a very nice, a very nice ratio. So yeah, I'll just leave it at that. Uh, that so thank you guys for watching and have a nice day.